Hey guys and welcome for a new video. So today we're doing a kind of a different video. It's a review video. So I'm gonna do a video like that once in a while when I feel the need of doing one if I'm buying new products and stuff like that. So I've bought a couple of things lately. So I've felt the need to tell you what I thought about it and stuff like that. So maybe you're interested in my new stuff and that would be really interesting. I'm feeling really out of breath. I don't know why for some reason. Anyway. So yeah, so I'm gonna pick three brands and pick out two products in those brands and tell you what I thought about it. So let's get cracking. First we're gonna start with the Bar Minerals um, eyeshadows 5-in-1. So they are... Packaging is really cute, I mean I love it. It's not an expensive brand, but um, it's a really great quality brand. I mean it looks really professional, I don't know, I really like it. I kept it in those books, I know I'm not gonna keep it forever. but. But yeah, so I've picked up Divine Wine and a Soft Shell. Um, Divine Wine was one of my first pick because uh, I um, watched a video from Ingrid Nielsen and she was actually using it and I was like, oh my god, what is that? I really need it in my life. Then I picked it up uh, like a couple of days ago and uh, I'm really, really happy with it. So what is the formula? Let me read uh, from the box. So it is a... Um, 5-in-1 Innovator BB, uh, I'm reading it in German. Pure color, amazing benefits, long wear color, prime, bright and smooth and protect. So it's BB Advanced Performance Cream Eyeshadows SPF 15. And actually, so it's 5-in-1 because there is all the ingredients that you need in your eyes. So when I put that eyeshadow that I'm wearing right now, actually, you don't need to put anything. I just put um, on my, at the top of my eyelid, some vanilla MAC eyeshadow because I like to brighten it a little bit more. I don't like to wear it on its own, but um, I just really like that product. The color is amazing. I mean, it's a really browny taupe color. And um, it's really great and I just like the packaging as well and it really lasts all day long I mean that is really true I've, I've put it on this morning at 8 7 7 ish um, and it's still on and it looks amazing and it brightened my eyes and I just love that product and um, my mom bought me that one so soft shot because she was like that looks amazing on you you need something more light and i was like okay i don't like the beige color type of colors um in those kind of formula so i went for um the uh, soft shell which is a really nice I don't know if you can see it it's a really nice pinky color it's really cute so um, I've tried it on already and it's a really great product for a natural look. So overall, I really like those two products. I will definitely rebuy that product if I'm running out. Um, they're just amazing and um, I don't know, Bar Minerals do a really good job with those eyeshadows. And I probably will buy uh, other things from the brand like the powder because apparently they're amazing. but. Those eyeshadows, they are really great. Next uh, brand, which is NYX. Uh, I've discovered NYX recently in many thousand millions videos on YouTube, and I thought that I will try it on. So, um, as I said in a previous video, I don't like to order online. So, I went in one of my next uh, store and I picked up two products. So, the first one is the um, Extreme Shine Lip Cream. And it's in the color Dolly Girl. The color is amazing. The, um, the formula is amazing. It stays on your lips. It doesn't dry your lips. It looks really great. I like the fissure. Uh, it, it's not matte. It's not glossy. It's just terrific. It doesn't go on your teeth. That's one thing I hate about glosses. And it's not a gloss, it's really weird, so um, I don't know how to explain. I wanted to pick that first when I went to next. Uh, the lip butter and um, lip butter glosses, but they don't have it in store, you have to order them online. But um, I'm really surprised with that and I'm probably going to go and buy some other colors because I'm really impressed with it. 
um, you don't need to touch it up a lot and um, I don't know and the scent is amazing I really really love the scent of the, uh, their product because even the the blush which is the next product that I've picked up smells really good <laughs> so it's really weird for a blush so the next product is the blush which looks like that and um, it's the Rose Garden um, color and it's really it's glittery it's shimmery but it's really nice look at the pigmentation pigmentation is awesome I mean well you have to be really light handed with that kind of blush because you can look like a Barbie doll really easily so um, uh, but uh, for the price, they are amazing. They are really budget friendly. I think for both of them, uh, I was 13 pounds. So, I mean, everybody's talking about NYX or uh, NYX, depends. Everybody's pronounced that brand different ways. I'm gonna say NYX because it's easier. And um, so, yeah, I really love those two products and they're really, really great. So that they're my first pick. I've never tried before NYX and I'm really impressed with it. And I don't know, the colors are amazing and it's a kind of formula that you cannot find in drugstores uh, makeup. So, they nailed it. Last uh, brand I'm gonna review, uh, I mean it's a video about brands that I've never tried before so it's kind of funny for a first review video. So it's the Revolution uh, Makeup London um, palette. Um, de los Muertos palette. So it's the new brand. Um, I've discovered it uh, recently. Uh, they only sell their products in um, Superdrug at the moment, and they're really cheap, and the quality is amazing. So um, I've picked up few items from that uh, brand. I'm probably gonna do a video about the whole about the brand overall. So that's why I choose only two products from that brand. And um, but I was impressed mostly with those two products. So the first product is. Um, that palette and the colors are amazing I've talked about it in a whole already but I wanted to show you closely how it looks I mean the shimmery one are really great the matte one are amazing and the weird colored one are great as well um, I will probably do a tutorial at some point to try them all that's really funny because those colors, they, they fit perfectly the new Max Simpson collection and I couldn't get my, get my hands on them because they are sold out and I'm pretty pissed about it. But I'm can tr I can totally try like a Simpson inspired uh, dupe uh, look um, out of that palette with other stuff that I can find out there. So yeah, if you want me to swatch um, a couple of them, I can swatch the matte one if you want so here they are they're pretty great I mean this one is really really nice I'm so sorry I haven't kept the thick that says the name but they are really great um ooh, I've put stuff everywhere um they stay pretty well on your <laughs> on your on the tips of your fingers uh, and the shimmery one are just gorgeous I really love that one and I really use that one as well. It's a peachy, shimmery one. It's really gorgeous uh, with, uh, for example, the um, uh, Bar Minerals uh, eyeshadows, if you want to mix and match a bit. And I don't know, I haven't tried yet the, the really dark one because I didn't have the occasion, but I mean, I'm pretty impressed. It was only six pounds, so the quality is amazing. They are doing uh, several palettes, I think five or six different ones, plus bigger ones, so I think, I mean, that is amazing for the price. I really recommend it. And the second product of Revolution Makeup London is uh, the um, Focus and Fix Eye Primer. It was only $2.50 and it actually, it's actually a great product. Um, I recently bought the um, Rimmel one and I hated it, like hated it so, so much. I mean, it was five pounds, like, thrown away, because I used it once, I was like, yeah, I really don't like the texture, I really don't like uh, how it, did, it doesn't blend with the eyeshadows, so I'm really out of breath in that video for some reason. So yeah, uh, I like the fact that it's colored, so here we go. So see? So that's really great, so it melts really, really great with your eyeshadows, it's for a really great look, and it's actually 250 for the product, and it's worth every pet that you will put in that brand so i really really recommend it it's a really new brand and it's really like quality for uh the price and 
It's amazing. I just love it. I really love it. I have a dupe for the Urban Decay one, to my opinion. Uh, and it's way, way cheaper. I think the Urban Decay one is £16. So try this out and you will be amazed. Trust me. So for me it works. And I like the fact that it's not wide and it's colored. So thank you for watching, guys. Um, I hope you really enjoyed that video. Give it a thumbs up if you really liked it. And I will do more review videos in the future. And uh, have a great day. You know what to do. Follow me on social media and leave comments below if you have any. So have a great day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Give it a thumbs up too. Make that as mess. I will try...